Hey guys, it's me, Melissa Marie, and I'm so excited because I have a great video for you today. So my sister um, kind of helped me out with my bangs. I recently cut my bangs by myself. It was a catastrophe. She kind of helped shape them a little. And over the last couple of weeks, I've been just playing around, trying to get used to them and all that. So I think it was last weekend, um, I had them tucked back under a hat. So they were really, really stretched out. And she was like, let me refresh your bangs for you. So she, um, you know, she wet them and then she finger quilled them with a special cream that she has. I'm going to just do it with my products today. I'll show you what those are really quickly here. But other than that, I just want to hop into it. It's going to be a quick video. I'm going to do my whole hair. I washed my whole head. I washed my hair today. I'm not going to probably finger quill the whole thing. Probably just to maybe do two, trend, two strand twist or whatever. We're going to hop into it. You'll see. But I'm definitely going to focus on the bangs. So I just wanted to give a quick intro as we hop into the video. All right. I really hope this is a good angle and that you can see me. I'll probably switch the angle shortly. Um, I also have my mirror here. Okay. That's good. That's good for me. So, like I said, I'm going to focus on the bangs part. I just feel like I need to do that because I've never really finger coiled them. Ever since I got bangs, and I'm not going to talk a lot through the video, but ever since I did, like, start with the bangs, I usually just, like, I do kind of curl them a little, but it's mostly just a scrunching. When she did the finger coil thing, what I noticed was, like, for the rest of that week, the curls were, like, so together that... I mean, they weren't perfect every other day. You know what I mean? Like I had to refresh them a little, but I didn't have to wet them. I could kind of just keep it going. I can't really explain it. Bruh. Anyway, enough of me talking. Let's just hop right into the time lapse so we can see what it looks like. Okay, so the key with this style, my sister was telling me is that the key to the style is that you have to, while it's still drying, which may take a little while, you have to keep gently scrunching it. Like when she did it for me, like every little while she's like, remember to scrunch. So um, that's the key to it. So I'm gonna keep doing that like while it's drying, but I'm gonna go back into time lapse cause I'm gonna do the back of my hair now. And I'm just gonna do maybe a couple of two trains, two strands twists. Why is that so hard to say? So let's hop back into time lapse. Yeah. I'm back to real time now. Um, I did a mix of two strand twist and just like regular curling to the back. I'm not really worried about the back. It kind of does its own thing. I'm more so experimenting with the bangs here. So I'm gonna continue to just do the light scrunching. And I will check back in with you guys when like it has dried more and like I feel like it's styled or done or whatever. So see you guys soon. Okay guys, so I'm about <laughs> so I'm about halfway through the drying process and the curls are coming together really nicely. I feel like they were still better when my sister did it, but that's fine. But I'm gonna use the diffuser um on the the length part and I'll probably will use a little on the on this part too. So I figured I would just show you that really quickly. This is broken, so I have to like literally hold it. But let's see if it works. Yeah, I'm home. 
right, guys. So what do you think? I think it looks cute. I think it looks, you know, now that I was able to force the air in there a little bit, I feel like it gives it like a little more volume, a little more volume, a little more pump. Um, I'm just gonna put a little mascara on and I'm gonna come back and close out the video. Okay, guys, and here I am. I'm back, I'm finished with my hair. I separated the bangs just a little bit more, like pull the pieces apart. This is the hair. I feel like it came out pretty good. Um, feel like I need to put like a little bit of oils in it, like jojoba oil or I don't know, some type of oil in it. But other than that, uh, I I like it. And I really hope you just enjoyed this quick little video um, on this semi new process specifically pertaining to like the bangs now um with my kind of like hair update curly routine i mean I, the process will always kind of be the same which is put some type of cream and then some type of holding gel or cream and then kind of let it dry or diffuse it i very rarely diffuse it but i really wanted to try harder in this video if that makes sense i wanted to like see if i can get it dry quicker see how it will come out if i put that little bit of extra oomph into it so i really do hope you enjoyed the video as always thank you so much for watching i truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart so thank you so so much and i'll see you in the next video